to The Early Show, everybody. I'm Maggie Rodriguez here with Harry Smith and a whole lot of people who love Aruba. And I don't blame them because as I just learned from them, Harry, it is 82 degrees year round Every single in Aruba. day. Right. Every single Lewis day. Lewis Black does the commercials for Aruba, right? And yes. His yes. whole complaint is it's too nice here. I'll take it. Right. <laughs> Any day of the week. It's a breezy cold morning here on the corner of 59th and 5th. We appreciate you stopping by. Here bon vini, as they say in Aruba. Welcome. There you go. Uh, and just at about five minutes past the hour, good time for a check of your weather on this Monday morning. Lonnie Quinn is in for Dave Price this morning. Good morning again, Lonnie. Hey, good morning. My goodness, do we have some uh, hooping and hollering people because it's a one happy island in Aruba. Uh, just quickly, just, just quickly. Ma'am, what is your name? Geraldina Cotillo Myers. Geraldina, how are you doing today? And listen, uh, where in Aruba are you from? I'm from Oranjestad. And is that where you bought the scarf and the fur coat in, <laughs> in Aruba where it's 82 degrees? Let's talk about the weather that we see outside. It's Aruba on the plaza, apparently home to 90,000 friends that you have not yet met yet. And I'm looking at the crowd here and I'm thinking, I'm thinking all these people can't possibly be from Aruba. But you, sir, you look like you got that look. You got the dreads going. You look like you're from Aruba. Where are you from? The west side of Aruba. Is that anywhere close to the west side of Manhattan? No. no. <laughs> all right. Hey, listen, you stay cool, my friend. Let's get inside to Harry. wearing a Ruben supporting folk. And a Lonnie. couple of scantily clad. Well, it's very interesting <laughs> because oh, yeah. well. when Lonnie comes most Mondays when he fills in for Dave, I don't know why, but these people show up. You know, I don't know what the deal is, but... It's so like the just, Pied Piper here. It is a kind of a cult <laughs> following he has. We'll explain that more in a little bit. <laughs> Welcome back to the early show. Coming up, Chris O'Donnell is here. <laughs> Chris O'Donnell. Another BC guy? BC guy, yeah. Right. Huge hit, the NCIS spin-off. Los Angeles. Right, mm -hmm. with uh, LL Cool J. They've been uh, signed for a new season already. Monster audience, great chemistry with the two guys, and we'll talk to him about that in a little bit. Also ahead this morning, can the fountain of youth be found at the end of a straw? We're going to tell you about little things, little changes that you can make that help you look younger, like getting rid of straws. See, now, I would have thought using a straw might be better for you, but no. But no, and we'll explain why ahead this wait, morning. Wait, wait, wait. Mm. Because maybe it would save your teeth. You go to the dentist, and in they say, Use a straw, use a straw. They say drink coffee out of a straw. Exactly. Drink for, wine it's good out for of your straw. teeth, but is it good for your skin? Ah. You get those pursed lips. <laughs> Maybe we could That's have a knockdown, smack down, <laughs> smack down <laughs> sort of fight between a dermatologist That's what it's gonna and, be. A, you didn't see the and a dentist. Or the dentist or yeah. There's a little something in college about drinking beer out of a straw. But well, that's another whole other story. I think that was a funnel, but that's <laughs> yeah. another story. There's a big straw. So, yeah. <laughs> also with us this morning, in case you haven't heard, the men, all men want to smell like, and women would like to perhaps get a whiff of the Old Spice guy, the new Old Spice guy. Say hello to Isaiah Mustafa. He's gonna join us with a really funny story about how he got this commercial in the first place, which has not only the internet buzzing, but the early show, especially our own Maggie Rodriguez <laughs> buzzing. <laughs> yeah, I think he's very funny. Well, you've been talking an awful lot about him, Maggie. You've been all over the he's internet checking him out. Very funny. Sure. He's Amusing. Very, very funny. No, it has nothing to do with the abs. <laughs> no. He's nothing at abs. Uh, no, no, no. Oh, he has, he's a good looking man. He has abs? <laughs> <laughs> hey, you know what we're going to talk about, guys? Please. A little bit of weather out there. Dave Price is off today, so I'm going to take the helm here. All of this colorful garb you see behind me, it's all about Aruba, but you know what? Talk about colorful garb. Check out the national dancers while they do their thing. <laughs> Something tells me it's a little tougher to do this with the headgear on. Speaking of headgear, you can't talk Aruba without putting a little headgear on. So here we go. This is the best I can do, people. We are going to talk. Oh, I like it. I like it. I like it. Let's talk some weather out there because here's what's happening. Aruba, beautiful today. Sunshine temperatures in the 80s. <laughs> Not going to happen anywhere in the United States like that. It's windy for the northeast. The toughest weather out there is going to be around the Texas area, pushing into the New Orleans area. The bayou catches some big-time rain. Keep your eye on that one. It pushes to the southeast tomorrow. And if you keep your fingers crossed in the northeast, it should stay to the south of you. That is a quick look at the national picture. 
You guys were fantastic. Keep it going. Keep it going. Here's an early look at what's going on in your area. And Lonnie's doing the Lucy show. <laughs> Remember with the headgear? I love that. Hey, I tell you what, though. Big headgear, a little bit of a problem is we've got gusty winds to deal with. Uh, uh, watch out. We'll see gusts 30, 40 miles an hour later today. Sprinkle chance, yes, to the east. We've been watching a little bit of light rain parts of Suffolk County and into Connecticut. Not a big deal, but a chance for a few more showers Tuesday. A more pronounced chance of some rain, rain, snow mix on Wednesday. Notice we're cooler midweek, but then we're going to warm up. This is, this is great, guys. Apparently, you have no idea that it's cold out here. Harry, let's get inside to you. All right, thanks very much, Lonnie.